They just never heard anyone like me before. That's fine. I opened a whole new world for them. Or so I thought. I guess I was wrong. They weren't impressed by me. They were mocking me. Turns out when I took the life of the scientist, I also inherited his poor musical talent. I was heartbroken. I thought other musicians would be like me. That they'd take me in. You need all different sounds to make a song, right? After all my searching, it felt like I didn't belong anywhere. If I couldn't belong with them, I had nowhere else to go. I was a failure of a musician. I failed the scientist while he was alive, and now I don't even have him left to go back to. My journey was long and hard at times. All I wanted to do was give up. Then, at last, I finally found a similar form of life. Bum, bum, bum. Musicians. They made a beautiful sound, but I knew exactly what it needed. We made incredible music together, but for some reason, they stopped. They seemed surprised, maybe, but never consistently. Darn it's work! Ah! All of this work for nothing? I lost my family. I lost my music. I have to keep working. I cannot fail. It finally hit him. He was alone in the world, but he decided there was no problem that couldn't be solved with science. It's okay. It's okay. I know exactly what to do. He began to build something bigger, more complex, more human. He had created me, the final form of Wubox in all my glory. It's... it's beautiful. Now let's see if it works. Right arm? Good. Left leg? Excellent. Now for the real test. Making music. Sing, my creation! He set the generator to its highest power. Something dangerous for the both of us. Come on! Work! Work! I don't need them anyway. Just a distraction. Looks like it's just you and me. And that's fine. When I'm finished with this robot, it'll be like they never even mattered. I started off small, but he wouldn't stop there. He got better and better at building and started to make real progress. Yes, everything is going according to plan. At this rate, my Wubbox will be complete within the year. Within a few months, even. But he came to a road bump that same day. Huh? What's going on? His creation had a lot of potential, but never a strong enough power source. It could only run for a few seconds. Far better than he ever could. Daddy! I want to play catch! Maybe in a few minutes. I just have to weld these parts. We were so good an hour ago! I want to play now! Honey, can you play catch with him? You know, he's your son too. You really ought to spend more time with him. I will, when I'm finished. Well, seems like you're never finished. Just let me keep working. Fine. Dinner's at six. I'll just leave him here. He was really committed to his work. One day he looked up from his desk, and he realized his family was gone. He became so obsessed with making this robot that he neglected the real people in his life. You think that would teach him a lesson, but instead, he threw himself even further into this project. So is he. <laughs> Hopefully he grows up to be better than his old man, huh? And with a baby on the way, he decided to change his career paths. He studied science, some kind of fancy engineering. He wanted to build a robot that could make music far